are me precious acorns. Now I've got more. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, you. Huh? Yes, you, the mammoth. Have you ever heard of the legend of the Acorn Island? Ah, uh, no, it doesn't sound familiar. Well, in that case, I should like to tell you the legend of the Acorn Island. There once was a squirrel named John Scrat. He pillaged and plundered and sailed the seven seas often, as he hunted for acorns. At the acorns he took, he stashed away at a hidden island known as the Acorn Island. No one knows where the Acorn Island is, and those who tried to find it have never come back. And that, my friend, is the legend of the Acorn Island. Well, that was some legend, all right. Wait a minute, I just had the best idea ever. Hi Manny, what's up? Hi Sid, I just had the best idea ever. But I don't want anyone to steal my idea, it needs to be a secret. You're right, that's a great idea, but I think we should get Diego on our side first. Hey, I just had the best idea ever. Ah, Manny, you made me lose him. Hey, you won't worry about that macropedia as much as this amazing idea I just had. Oh, all right. Tell me anyway. Oh, yeah. That was a great idea. Guys, we need to leave this place first. You're right, we do need to leave. And I know a fun way out. And there it is. It's a big snowy hill that I think is going to be really fun to slide down on. Come on guys, what do you say? Whee! <laughs> that was so fun.
All right, here we go. Uh, yeah, that was so much fun. Let's do that again. <laughs> oh, we were just, um, uh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Hey, I saw you earlier, Mammoth. What are you doing here? Guys, this is that bear I told you about earlier. Hey, remember that Acorn Island you told me about? My friends and I want to look for the Acorn Island. Could you help us find where it is? I must warn you, no one knows where Acorn Island is, and those who tried to find it have never come back. But if you insist, I suppose I should help you anyway. There are some docks where you can get a ship to do your journey. All you have to do is cross straight through that dark spooky forest. On the other side is a pretty popular place where you'll meet a lot of creatures. But it won't be long until you find the docks. That's all I know. Thanks for the advice. <sighs> I have a feeling that things are not going to go well for them. That bear was right. This forest really is dark and spooky. Yeah, especially the spook. This place gives me the creeps. Yeah. We better be careful. We better stick together if we want to get out of here. I wonder where this leads to. Here we are. Hey, you! Yes? My friends and I want to go on an adventure to look for Acorn Island. Could you help us? Why, I was just happening to set up to go there myself. You can join me if you want. That's great. No, that's perfect. We'll join you. Welcome aboard, Mammoth. The name's John Scrat. Huh. I remember a bear telling me the legend of Acorn Island. Wasn't there a squirrel pirate named John Scrat who stashed acorns away there? If so, it's funny that you're also a squirrel named John Scrat. Hmm. <laughs> And so me name is, coincidentally. We better get on board now and search for the Acorn Island and get ourselves some acorns. Um, guys, something doesn't seem right about this. Uh, 
no need to worry. I'm sure it'll be just fine. Seasick. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm seasick too. <laughs> Even I'm seasick. <laughs> <laughs> Are we ever going to make a stop? We've been at sea for like a week now. Yes, we will stop at Icy Isles to restock on food and supplies. We should be there in about three hours. And Scud will be stopping for once after all these days of travel. But three more hours of being on sea. Uh... Ah, here we are, gentlemen. Icy Isles. I need you three to go and look for some food and supplies so we can be sent on our way. I will stay with the ship. Ah, uh, this should take care of things for once. <laughs> huh. I just thought of something. Where are we supposed to find food and supplies on this island? <sighs> I'm not sure myself. We just need to do a good job of searching. That's all I can say. Guys, why do I get the feeling that we're lost? What makes you say that, Sand? We've been wandering around this island for a while now, and we haven't found any food or supplies yet. We haven't met anyone here either. I have a feeling this place is abandoned. It gives me the creeps. <gasps> Oh, beware of the giant mammoth. He's ferocious. He's a nightmare. Get out of here if you want to live. Huh? Giant mammoth. Hmm. I wonder what he was talking about. I'm sure it's some silly superstition that goes around in these parts.
<sighs> I think Sid's right. I'm feeling a little lost here, too. Yeah, I'm starting to question this place myself. Perhaps we should regroup with the captain. I'm starting to be not convinced that there's any food or supplies here. I say we investigate this island to see what it really is. I strongly agree with you, Diego. We really should investigate. Manny! <laughs> that was fun! Who dares disturb me? Aw, oh, who's that? Uh-oh. You have come to steal my berries, haven't you? My crew and I stopped by so we could pick up some food and supplies. Legend has it anyone who enters Icy Isles never leaves Icy Isles. I have a funny feeling you're gonna chase me now. I warned him all right. Guys. We gotta get out of here. Don't think about stealing my berries ever again. I'm really disappointed we didn't get any food or supplies when we were back on that island. Well, at least we gotta stop from all this sea traveling. Not to worry, me mateys. We will be making another stop eventually. On our first stop, I got chased by a fellow mammoth that's bigger than me. What's next? Our next stop will be Dinosaur's Battlefield. Legend has it that island is home to dinosaurs who have always been at civil war with each other. Dinosaurs at Civil War? That sounds crazy! Well, this is one crazy trip then. Well, that wasn't so bad, eh? We didn't travel for as many days as we did on our way to our first stop. Will we actually get food and supplies this time? Don't worry, me mateys. We'll get some food and supplies, alright? I hope what you said about the dinosaurs is just a superstition. Because I don't want to be involved in that. Yeah, me neither. We just want some food and supplies, Captain. Ah! Uh, oh, there really are dinosaurs on this island. Are you here to help the Resistance? 
Where did that scummy rebel go? <clears throat> Run off before I use me sword. Say, are you here to help the Resistance? We've been traveling at sea for several days now. We came by to temporarily stop. But we'd be glad to do what we can to help you out. Splendid! Come with me and I'll introduce you to the other members of our rebellion. Alright, we'll come. So, that squirrel decided to stay with the ship. Let me guess, he's the captain of the crew. I guess you could call him that. I should like to get you introduced to the members of our resistance. I am Davadar, and I am currently in charge of the resistance. Let me introduce you to some of my fellow rebels. Meet Bogart. And this is Shadan. There is also Arnak, who is on watch duty right now. You see, we are a resistance against the Order of the Dragon. A regime that wants to take over this island. This regime is led by Lord Dragoon. A tyrant dragon who wants to rule this island with an iron fist. Davidar, Order of the Dragon forces are headed our way. They were coming from the west, and Lord Dragoon himself is leading this attack. From the west? That's where our ship is. Aw, oh, I hope the captain's okay. It's time to prepare for the ultimate battle, troops. We're gonna be battling Lord Dragoon himself. I've been waiting a long time for this moment, Davidar. I am General Ragnarok, and I swear my life to the Order of the Dragon. End your resistance while you still can, Davidar. Never! Don't you realize the Order of the Dragon is going to lead to the downfall of this island? Enough of your rebellion, Zipperus. The Order of the Dragon wants to take away our freedom and our independence. They want us to live a harsh life. That's not cool, man. Dragon Troopers, eliminate all that remains of the Resistance. At last, we get to fight the Resistance once again. Yeah, let's go! Thanks, Davidar. <laughs> ah, yes, the resistance. I have waited a long time for this moment. Well, I got the opportunity to be introduced to General Ragnarok. Enough of your smart mouth, Davidar. Lord Dragoon, 
Can we finally get rid of this resistance? Please do so. I shall enjoy seeing the resistance finally be crushed. Oh no, this is not gonna be pretty. Hmm, I have an idea. Hey, Arnak. Yes? Could you help me get onto that flying creature up there? I don't see why not. You ready? Yes, I'm ready. <laughs> yeah, time for some fancy flying. What is going on? What is all of this? No one does this to Lord Dragoon and gets away with it. Your friends have proven a good point. You have earned my respect. I shall no longer continue my conquest. You could say that I slayed the dragon. <laughs> Thanks, guys. We appreciated the help. It's been nice knowing you, but we gotta go now. I understand. And I bid thee farewell. It'd be nice if we met again someday. Well, we better get going now. Come on, guys. <sighs> How did that not work? Captain, you should have seen what Sid was doing. It was amazing. I'm pretty sure it was <sighs> amazing. Come on, we better get going. Our next stop is going to be Acorn Island. So, you said that Acorn Island's gonna be our next stop, Captain? Yes, me Sabertooth lad. And we'll be there sooner than it took us to get to those other stops. At last, me lads, we have found the legendary Acorn Island. Yeah, that was some journey. Now let's go get some acorns. Yeah, now that's what I'm talking about, Sid. Unlike our past stops, I will accompany you this time. The raining. Huh. <sighs> Captain. I'll hold them off for you guys. And you know me, I've been in situations with humans before.
I took on a lot of you guys. <sighs> but I don't think I can take any more. <sighs> Hey, Jed! Aloha there, my dude. It's nice to see you here, Jed. But what are you doing here? I've actually been living on this island for a while now, my dude. There was a lot that happened ever since we last met. The most important thing that happened since we last met was that I made two new friends, Manny and Diego. That's cool, mon frere. Nice to meet your new friends. This is Acorn Island, after all. Say, are you here to look for the acorns? Absolutely. Do you know where the acorns are? Absolutely, bruh. Follow me. Watch this, my dudes. Open sesame. Whoa! How did you... It works every time, my dude. Now come on, the acorns are in here. What did I tell you guys? The acorns are right here. Wow, this is so cool. <laughs> but that's not all, bros. There's even more up here. And here it is. The jackpot load of acorns. You're right, Zid. This is a jackpot load of acorns. <sighs> I'm here, and I see ya lads have found the acorns, and you've made a new acquaintance too, eh? I should like for the mammoth to go fetch the treasure chests, so we can gather up the acorns for the taken. As you wish, Captain. What? These treasure chests are loaded with acorns. Hmm, something's not right about this. You two slugs and tiger learn that no one gets to my acorns. Ha 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 ha. Captain John Scrat, what do you think you're doing? No one takes the acorns of Captain John Scrat. Well, why did you bring us here in the first place? I seek to eliminate any who threaten my horde of acorns. It was my idea to look for Acorn Island, so before you can touch any of my friends, you're gonna have to deal with me first. I like you, lad. You've got a burning spirit of fire, but it has come to this. So be it. Ah! 
Catch me if you can, mammoth. Now, eh? The only way I can defeat you is to destroy this island. Me and my acorns along with it. That was a bad mistake of you, Captain. Come on, guys, we need to get out of here. Yeah, we are so out of here. Apparently, the explosion from the island has sent us flying back home. That was a spectacular adventure. Look, guys, we got some of the acorns. Uh. 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 My... Acorns. I shall have my revenge. Whoa, Captain. You have taken my acorns, and I shall... shall... shall have a change of heart instead. It's nice to know that, Captain. I guess that collecting too many of those has made me greedy. You ever thought of using the acorns in some way? Just now I have. Tonight we shall have an acorn feast. Ay, that was a good feast. Yep. Say, you want to join our herd? There's always room for more. I would love to join your herd, but I feel that my life stays with pirating acorns just for the fun of it. I understand you, Captain. Do as you wish. I too should be going, mon frere. I hope that we meet again someday, Zid. Me too, and I hope to see your new friends with you as well, and any other friends you might make later. Bye, Captain. Bye, Zid. Well, that was some adventure we just went on. We best be going now. You're right. Let's go.